Hello folks and welcome to another episode of Carl's Copters. If you've never seen the show before or the channel before, don't forget to subscribe because it's got all sorts of niche channels of mine. Anyway, today we're going to review another lawnmower. It's the Red Classic. It's got 35 litre collection capacity. It's got 5 foot in height and uh, 13 inches or 33 centimetres cutting width. And it's got a 2 year guarantee. It's a bit noisy out here today. It's electric power. 13 watt motor, electric like I said, and that's it there. I'm going to zoom out a little bit for you, and we're going to get stuck in, straight in. Right then, without further ado, let's uh, open, open this bad boy up. In the box. Right. I'm going to open it up, and we'll see what's inside. Okay, so inside we have the cable, nicely neatly wrapped up, packed away. Also got an instruction sheet and address there. I take it that's the um, warranty card, what have you. Put that aside. Got a bag, a handle there that I put on. Got some bolts, cable clips. On that side. Then, Got the handle itself nice and solid. This feels really weighty. This handle already a, a nice foam grip, quite heavy. That doesn't feel light at all. Weather's rubbish out today, so now you can hear the wind blowing and all sorts. Something lower that gently. Then we've got something under here. Take that bubble wrap off. There's where the handle is to go on there, look. Got a lovely brass box. Fantastic. Nice folding brass box, that's what we like. What's inside? Nothing. Plenty of room. It's got web written on the side. Very. And that's where it's got look. Stop and go. So when it's not full. Oh yeah, here we go. When it's not full the flat be open like that. When it's full. It obviously won't get the air through and it tells you it's full. Okay. So we got that. Crikey, nothing in here. Got all sorts of we've got some more handle parts here. Here they are, handle parts. Beautiful, lovely. Put them again. Okay. One side. So here's the mower itself. Do you know what? I prefer them with wheels, me. It's got height adjustment there, so it just lowers the front wheels down, obviously. And uh, handles come off, it says push here, I imagine. Looks alright, quite like the look of that. But I'm going to get it out, and then what I'm going to do... Quite heavy, actually. I'll lift it upside down first. Of the plug. Anyway, so that's the height adjuster there. You can see upside down here. And then we're gonna have a bit of a route round. So this is the blade, nice metal blade. None of this messing about with those spaces, hate them. Cooling fan, feels all nice and tight, brilliant stuff, easy to change, one bolt, sticks it on, follow the arrows, so it turns that way around. Where does the air come out of? Hello everybody, so this is where the grass comes out from the mower, fantastic, so far easy to replace axle there, easy, so far so good, Look quite robust, plastic's really thick, doesn't feel cheap, it does feel weighty, nice robust wheels there, really strong wheels, no rubber on them, you don't want rubber on them I suppose. Uh, right. So without further ado, put it together. Okay, so this is it fully assembled. It took about five minutes to do. Just read the instructions really curvy. It looks really fantastic. 
and uh, it does look like a petrol lawnmower to be honest. It's even got a fancy cable tie thing here. Look at that. Just look at the quality on it. Nice, strong, enjoyable plastic. There's a really thick tube of steel. It does look like a uh, petrol lawnmower. It's not exactly light. I would not get that to lift up though. Well. It's pretty heavy so you know it's going to be well built. It says it's 98 decibels of sound. It's got adjustable height there. And also you can fold it with the uh, things. And also we can even adjust it again to the next level as well. So, looks pretty good so far. Oh, 96 decibels. There you go. So that's what that is. So I'll let me that better do. I'm going to give it a go. So let's see how it cuts. Okay, so the mower's all done, looking fantastic, and it's got a bit of dust on the handle, so it does look like the petrol mower, you press this in, there, and then you pull the lever, like so, easy as peas, and uh, the grass, the grass is pretty long folks, let's look how long that grass is, so, what I'm going to do, I'm going to probably cut it, you know, So that's a yeah. The only thing I've noticed, my wheels are a different colour at the front. But other than that, great mower. Probably one of the best mowers you can get. So there you go, that's the web. Thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And who knows what more cruel and great fantastic things are coming on the show. So what the first thoughts of it? Fantastic, not too noisy, <laughs> looks amazing. It's not actually that heavy when you start lifting it up proper. If you use the two handles, handle there uh, and lift it with the handle, it's not that bad really. And uh, looks really good. Looks like a really high-end lawnmower. Wait till I tell you the price of this. You're gonna, you're not gonna believe it. I've reviewed mowers before in the past. You can check them all out on my channel. But this one, for the money, is number one. It was ninety-three pounds. How easy and how cheap was that? It's really good, well worth the money. Lots of features, height, it's the uh, grass cutting things, collection box, easy to uh, cable storage, which is fantastic as well. Neatly folds away, handle folds down as well, but I always keep mine up. And uh, all around good looking mower. So if you want to get one of these, don't forget. Nice easy folding grass box as well. Uh, really, really well. Well, we get to go and get one. But this is definitely probably the best mower that's corded and electric that I've ever used. I'm not just saying that. I've just tried it, and the grass is absolutely perfect now. Anyway, it took the long grass easy, no problem. So uh, there you go. Hope this helps. If you want to buy a cheap mower that's really good. This is definitely by far the best, and it comes with two-year warranty as well. So there you go, folks. Cheers anyway. Thanks a lot.